Snail, if you really cared about me, you'd just throw it to the same spot 70 times in a row. Okay? If you truly cared about the fate of the universe, and the galaxy, and my Peachy's wedding, which she doesn't even want, you would throw it in the exact same spot over and over and over again. Forever. It seems you don't care about the universe. It seems you don't care about, about anything. Except for tossing a fucking ball around and on the beach. I think, uh... I think you might have commitment issues. And that really disappoints me, but you know what? We can get over this together. And, uh, by getting over it together... Well, maybe something grand will come out, you'll give me a power moon, and I will walk away and never talk to you ever again. And honestly, that's... that's a pretty sweet dream, honestly. I think, I think that both of us could benefit from this a lot. Never, ever seeing each other ever again. And if we do happen to see each other, we just ignore each other. Like, you're going down the road, and I see you, and then I awkwardly pretend as if I didn't see you. Uh, you do the exact same because you're like, wow, that was a really unfortunate experience. And I go, yeah, that really, really, really sucked when we were just on the beach for like an hour, just fucking tossing a ball, tossing a hat, and it just, it was just terrible. Really, truly, absolutely annoying. And you know what? That's okay, because sometimes you need bad experiences in life to be able to appreciate the better experiences in life. You can understand, you know, who you care about more, who you value as a friend more. And that's great, because you're not on that list of friends, and therefore I don't have to value you at all, Mr. Snail. I can just say, you know what? I just, I didn't really like that guy. I didn't even learn his name. He was just like, oh, you did a good job throwing stuff off the court, dude. And honestly, I didn't really, I didn't really take to that too kindly. At first, it was nice. It was like, oh, he, he he's treating me nicely. That's pretty cool. But then I realized that you're a pretty honestly cruel guy. All I want to do is gather power moons so that way I can reach certain endings of the game. And and you're just like, I don't think I want to do that. I think I'm just going to fuck around and ask that you hit this goddamn ball 100 fucking times. And I'm done. 